Welcome to this brief uh, demonstration of uh, the Learning Genius Academy, which is our virtual accelerated learning environment. So what we've tried to capture here is uh, an accelerated learning environment which contains both content to be delivered to employees, uh, which can be accessed anytime, anywhere online, and also has the opportunity to be blended with live training events. Um, making it a hugely powerful interactive e-learning experience um, and getting the benefits of, of, of mixing. So we have here a personalized environment. So the system knows who we are. As a result, it knows what we've done and can record and score everything that we do. It, it contains our courses and our portfolio. And of course, it is a place for support and help and contact. Um, so what we'll do here is we'll go straight into our course and the course is made up of uh, rich uh, multimedia and uh, when we go into the course it's divided into a series of learning chunks and learning units so it's a very progressive uh, course layout um, there are a variety of different um, ways that the material is presented we have uh, video I'll give you a quick example here Jerry McLaughlin and welcome to Starring Performance. Today is a celebration. Together we'll be celebrating some of your successes in the workplace. And so the idea is that we've got a virtual presenter facilitator and if you're in a live environment you may wish to use these videos along with your own presentation. Um, every single activity we've got here, this is a simple text box uh, response required there. Is, um, is recorded so there'll be learning and then an activity lots and lots of activity to make it very engaging and interactive um, learning environment uh, here we've got uh, a card game so I'm just going to show you a couple of the different types of uh, activities that we have here I've already played this game so it's showing my cards but I'm going to play the card game here this is just one of the types of uh, accelerated learning that we've got um, the idea here is out of 18 choices I'm going to choose two that most um, that will most benefit me these are uh, we're trying to find out what are the two things um, that most appeal uh, benefits appeal to an employer so something they'd most like to get out of their job so we keep um, playing the game by uh, drawing more cards and each time we select uh, the card that's least appealing and eventually it leaves us with two so I've uh, chosen just by somewhat ad hoc to make my work more successful that's a good one I'd most like to get better tools and resources to do my work They're perfectly reasonable so I've selected those that's reported to the system here task complete and then as we move through the course here it's asking me to review the personal action plans that will help me achieve those benefits so I've now got the front and the back of the card uh, displayed to me. These are the two I chose. It also offers me the opportunity to make any notes, which I won't do just at the moment, uh, just for time. And I'll save that activity. And the system again shows that I've got another. I've got an activity left over. Okay, excellent. The other types of um, events that uh, and activities that we can host within here um, are things like. Um, answering quizzes and questions and we've got a very interactive quiz and question here which I have played before but we'll play it again the previous score was 10 out of 14 I'm going to play the quiz and this is uh, deciding whether a statement is a fact or an interpretation so I'm going to start the quiz um, that's an observation and it gives me the answer and the way this system is designed and uh, this is very typical of uh, Anthony's learning design everything that you do is designed to speed up um, the learning the learners experience here so we're giving answers which helps inform um, the learner that's the interpretation um, helps them understand what they're trying to do so they, they get to, it deepens their learning as quickly as possible okay so I'm doing pretty well here I'm just going to run through these very quickly now I'm just going to uh, alternate just so we get to the end of the uh, the quiz okay. 
and so I can review my answers or submit my results. So I'm going to submit my results, which are not quite as good as last time, but I can live with that. And uh, we could uh, at this point say, right, okay, um, I finished for the moment. I'll come back to this later, but just before I disappear off, where where have I got to? So I go to my portfolio. And everything I've done has been recorded here, showing my progress and giving me a score, both in terms of completeness, uh, in the sense of completing tasks, and in terms of the quality of my responses here. So I've got in the meet the press section here, so I've just done it, showing that I got nine answers right, um, and I've completed that task, and I've got a bit more to do in that unit yet. So the whole system is designed very much to uh, support a learner's uh, development, is very much about capturing the learner's development, but uh, especially in the consolidation area, which is the second part of the course, which is called In Review. This is very much about taking the learning uh, that's taken place and giving the learner the opportunity to consolidate what they've learned in a very real and practical way. Um, so Anthony here has designed it in such a way that um, it's going to give you an opportunity to write more storyboards, to tell your story of your successes uh, in that format. And this document can then be printed out and presented um, to uh, your manager in your conversation when you actually go into your real life performance management review. So you've got the learning contained within the course. It captures all your responses so you can reflect upon them at a later stage. Um, and then in review it goes on to consolidate that learning so you actually put it into a practical process. So that's the, the learning design that Anthony's come up with. So lots of learning chunks, uh, lots of video to support and engage the learner, uh, lots of activities so it makes it very interesting and the, all the activities are interactive so they're recorded to the system and that you can review them later. You can also um, pass comments on your learning uh, which may form the basis of um, discussion with your with your line manager as well. So you may wish to um, make a general comment, add a general comment here, um, something like, you know, I am enjoying the process and it is clear I need to understand and I am providing factual evidence as opposed to an inter interpretation. That could be a very significant learning development for a user uh, of the system, a learner, an employee, and would demonstrate a good understanding to their boss of what they need to do to improve um, in this particular instance. Um, and the system can also report those comments back from the manager. And that makes it much easier for the manager to have a conversation if they have a record of the progress and the quality of the responses that their learner has um, has provided, their employee has provided during the learning process. So it's all about making it real and relevant to work, getting the uh, user to be very engaged and to interact within the system. Okay, so I'll, I'll stop there and... Um, and leave all the details of the learning design to be described to you uh, by Anthony who designed the course. Cheers, thanks for watching.